Hello once again, and you knew this was coming if you watched my last talking on the camera video. Right, we got a new world champion, Max Verstappen. Well, controversial, it might well be, but Max Verstappen is world champion, so congratulations to him. You know, Lewis Hamilton's run is stopped, but wasn't that close wasn't that very close that goes back to 2014 when i think it was the last time it was very close went to the wire but i was with the same team this is absolutely different really because max verstappen was in a different team red bull so we finally get a team and a driver that's capable of competing unlike ferrari when they was doing well then they go and fuck it up yeah, well, that's typical Ferrari, isn't it? Where have they been ever since? Well, will they make a comeback? Well, they need to get their management sorted out. Um, I think they've got some talented drivers, but they need a decent car with consistent um, management. Like with the Schumacher days, Ross Braun, John Top, that sort of days when Ferrari were dominant. They need another team like that. Um, and... Um, Red Bull have always been a good team, you know, since like the Vettel days, you know, when Vettel started coming on strong. I mean, he was um, champion with that team four times, Consist consistency, you know, from 2010 to 2013. So Red Bull, you could say, are back. But that was very, very close, wasn't it? It's been a... It's been a season where it's been, you know, Red Bull have been dominant. You know, I, they had the superior car um, about the middle of the season, uh, beginning, you know. I think the regulations did um, upset the Mercedes team where they've been so dominant. But congratulations to Mercedes as they won their eighth championship in a row. So Red Bull didn't win the championship this time. But, you know, that was very close. But, I don't know, it was either going to be Lewis or Max. It looked like it was going to go Lewis's way, because I think they had the superior car. There's no doubt about it. Mercedes turned it up and was the better car towards the end of the season. Um, but, I'm sorry to say, even though Max deserved it, he was fucking lucky. Matt, um, Lewis had the dominant car. He was driving so well, you know, he had a set of tyres on. But, once again, was that a team decision? You know, a team either makes or breaks the championship. And I think um, Mercedes thought that was on the strategy, but a crash happened, which was always could occur. And um, Red Bull took advantage of that. Switched the tyres. And obviously, you know, that was a done deal. One lap to go. What was going on at the end? You know, I think this season's been a bit controversial with rules and shit like that. I don't know what's favouring one team, the other team. I'm not getting into that. Um, it's been one of those seasons, but it's been very close. It's been one of the most entertaining seasons of all time. It's been a really, really good season really good racing very close they've had made contact lots of times this year whose fault i don't know well i'm not getting into that you know what's done is done but it's been a very very good season and yes max was there at the end the team strategy called it spot on you know as i said it takes a team to win a championship as well as the driver Max Verstappen is a very talented driver, no doubt about it. He was, you know, when he made his uh, come on the scene, he just knew he was going to be a good driver. He was a bit dangerous at first. Maybe he can be a little bit dangerous, you know, with his driving style, but he made it clear that's what everyone's got to get used to. So that went down to the wire. It was a very good race. 
well, it wasn't actually. It was a bit boring in the thing. Not really much overtaking, but good with Perez, you know, playing the same game. You know, we've had some good racing this year. Max has won more races. He's had more pole positions this year. So, did the better truck driver win it? I would say so. I'll say Max deserved it. He's won more races. He's had more pole positions. Denied Max of his eighth world champion. That's the way it goes. But didn't stop Mercedes from winning the eighth constructors championship. So well done to Mercedes. Um, next year, completely different rules. Car rules are changing. It's going to hopefully provide much better racing. Hopefully we'll see more teams up there. George Russell going to Mercedes. Now will George give Lewis Hamilton a run for his money? He almost won it one time when he was at that Mercedes. Unfortunately the team fucked up. Bottas is going to um, Alfa Romeo. He'll probably be quietly forgotten about. Kimi Ryan Kunum, been in the sport for 20 years, now he's retiring. One time world champion. Yeah, new talent coming up. Should be interesting next year. If the new the new regulations of the cars, new tyres, you know, I think they're 18 inch instead of 13 inch or something like that. Yeah, I'm looking forward to next year. Hopefully we'll have more teams up there. We'll have Red Bull up there, Mercedes. Hopefully Ferrari will come back, McLaren. You know, hopefully we'll have some really good racing next year. Let's hope the new regulations sort it out. Will Hamilton win his eighth championship? Well, he's got, as I said, um, George Russell up there now. With his, is his teammate. And people say, oh, he's got the fastest car. Lewis Hamilton's got the fastest car. Well, so did Bottas. Five championships between, you know, that's how long he was with the team for, Bottas. Hamilton beat him five to nil. With Rosberg. Rosberg was at the team longer than Hamilton. Hamilton won two championships to Rosberg's one. Because he retired, you know. So, oh, Hamilton's got the fastest car. Well... He beat his teammate. That's what you hear. Now, now I wonder if they're going to say that against me. Oh, Max got the fast. No, I don't think so. It's a completely different story, I guess. Betcha. But, you know, I'm not taking nothing away from Max. He deserves it. Well, it's about fucking time Dutch won something. <laughs> they did fucking useless in the football. <laughs> now, all, all congratulations to Max, actually. All congratulations. You know, I'm not having to go at any Dutch people out there. <laughs> but congratulations you finally got a champion first Dutch world champion in Formula 1 well done, well done Max yeah that's all I've got to say congratulations to Max for Stappen and congratulations to Mercedes for winning it for the 8th time and you denied Lewis Hamilton Max well done you know now keep up that pressure you know as I said, there's going to probably be more competition next year. And I'm looking forward to it. It's been a good season this year. Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.